So uh, we've touched a little bit on the importance of, um, uh, of brand building, but we've also got to start from um, uh, how advertising works. So the way that advertising works is it works passively. So you are bombarded with hundreds, if not um, uh, thousands of commercial messages um, per day. So how on earth are you going to measure all of that? And um, there are various different um, uh, techniques. Um, but the most important way to do it is, is, is passively. So really understanding what the ad exposure is um, uh, for, for a consumer. Uh, and so um, what we've been able to see through our benchmark database over time is the, the effect of this. So if you look at a group of people um, who are who state that they have seen an advertise, uh, ad, so they've seen an ad for, um, let's say, Netflix, Okay. Turns out those people who say that they've seen that Netflix ad are basically Netflix customers. Mm. So they already are pretty positioned mm. uh, to that. They're already familiar with it. Now, they'll probably have gone past a Netflix ad and they'll probably have um, seen a Paramount Plus ad uh, uh, at the same time. But they'll state the Netflix one. They won't state the Paramount. They could have even just turned Netflix on and seen a doodum and like that sort of somehow gone in as an ad. You know? Exactly, yeah. exactly. So that goes into the head. And so if you ask them a survey and say, which of these ads have you seen? They'll say, I've seen the Netflix one. I haven't seen um, uh, the Paramount Plus one. <laughs> so what you then do is you analyze that data and you can see that those people who recall ads are far more likely to buy. And the reason they're far more likely to buy is because they're already customers. Yeah. So you have to really uh, understand those people who say that they haven't seen that ad and see the effect on those people. And so when you analyze that, you actually see that advertising works on those people. So they can't remember seeing that ad, but actually it's still having an impact on them. So if we go back to the Paramount Plus example, mm. what you'll see is those people will say, ah, oh, I haven't seen any Paramount Plus ads. We'll know that you have seen it. But when you analyze that data, you'll see that those people are far more likely to buy um, Paramount Plus or, or watch in, in this instance um, than those people who haven't seen that ad. So you kind of pull all this together and you realize, okay, advertising works passively. Uh, and I think that's um, uh, fairly well understood by most advertisers now uh, and most people working in, in the industry. However, you still do see amazing examples of, um, uh, of research not really understanding this.